Uh, let's get rid of the Japanese car and find out which of our three cars is the fastest round the track. Yeah. We'll be driving Maseratis on a race track in continental Europe. It just sounds good, doesn't it? What's the matter with you? Why does he look so miserable? I'm breaking my arm. Well, so if we're going to drive around the track, can I at least have one of those disabled knob things? You know? That's what I was doing with it. Yeah, like a four lift truck. That sounds fair enough. enough. So, whilst our colleague enjoyed his special breakfast, Richard and I attached his steering knob. Ready, no? And then we hit the track. The roots of this car. Well, they were planted during the 1957 German Grand Prix. Fangio, at the wheel of his Maserati 250F, overcame a 48-second deficit in 22 laps to win the race. He smashed the lap record 10 times. You don't lose a pedigree like that. Here we go. Feel the tail kick out a little bit. All the front go. There's the back. On the front. Oh, God. I've got it. Uh, flying laps in the Maserati. This is exactly what Sterling Moss did. In the convertible, James was very unhappy with his new steering wheel.